now that we have uh, organized our pictures and made sure they're all in the right order, we're actually going to cut them so that they they are in line with the narration that we're saying. That's why it's really important that you go slow and you make sure the kids really pronounce the words so that we have time that that they are logical and they go with what is being said. So what you want to do first is you want to change this view because you can't edit them in this. So you're going to need to go in the timeline view and you'll see that right here. Now this timeline view <coughs> will show you actually have these two little magnifying glasses. One increases, one decreases. So we're going to actually click the plus sign and increase it just to help us out and we'll get to the beginning. So what I want to do is I'm going to play this this narration and then I'm going to cut the pictures where I feel is appropriate. Now you can actually expand them at any point. If you just click on the picture and you'll see the little red, two red arrows dragging, you can actually expand them. And it doesn't really matter because you're going to cut them and then you're going to del delete part of it. So first of all, I'm going to listen to where it says Anne Frank. And when it says German, that is when the uh, I would like the German flag, which is right here, to pop up. So I'm going to listen and I'm going to watch up here. Anne Frank was a German-born Jewish girl. Okay, so I heard that German-born Jewish girl. So I'm just going to move this back. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to click this right here. And I'm going to just split the clip here. And if you press this button in this area and split the clip, that will help you to edit the pictures. So I'm going to just try that again. Anne Frank was a German-born... And as soon as it said German, then I clipped it. And now you'll see there's that picture one it's actually twice so now I'm just gonna delete the second part of it and I'm gonna start it over again just to make sure I got the timing down so let's watch again Anne Frank was a German born Jewish girl from the city of Frankfurt wrote a diary while in hiding so now I see the German the German is pretty much on I can maybe trim it I can also trim it just a little bit with this I'm going to try it again, see if it's a little bit better timing. And Frank is a German born. So now that I have the Jewish girl, I know Jewish girl is coming up next, and I want the Jewish flag. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to cut the second part right now. And then you'll see it's in two parts again. And I'm just going to delete the second part. And now if I just move it back, and I know that it says, Anne Frank was a German born. Jewish girl, and here comes the next part from the city of Frankfurt. So probably when I hear the word city, I'm going to cut the Jewish flag. So I'm going to start from the beginning. Anne Frank was a German-born Jewish girl from the city of Frankfurt. And then right when I heard the word city. Now again, I've deleted those pictures. So I have, or sorry, I've cut them. So I have them in two, two separate ones. So I'm just going to click on the second one, delete it. Now the city of Frankfurt will be up. And I'll just start it back. Anne Frank was a German-born Jewish girl from the city of Frankfurt. Wrote a and, then, and then I just continue to cut like that. So you want to make sure that when you cut it, you, you delete the second part using this cut button. And as you go, you can actually, if for example, if something is not long enough, I can pull this out and extend it so that I make sure that I have enough time to go on to the next phase. Make sure, also make sure that you, you're clicking save as you go since Movies Maker does tend to mess up and uh, shut down your computer once in a while. So I'm just going to click this and save my project here. So that is how you cut the pictures. Good luck with the rest of your project.